begin our Mass at the First Church of Inebriantity with a quote from the Book of Cordials and Liquors. The LSC Rugby Electric Gelatin. One box of lemon lime gelatin, two cups of peppermint schnapps. That was a schnapps. Silent infidel! Mix ingredients together, pour into Collins glasses and chill for one and a half hours. Serve with a straw. Straw. Make straw. Four to five servings. Straw, man. So saith the Lord. Go. Are you gonna take Japanese? A reading from the Book of Whiskey. I'm writing. A congressman once asked by a constituent to explain his attitude toward whiskey. If you mean that demon drink that poisons the mind, pollutes the body, desecrates family life, and inflames sinners, then I'm against it. The congressman said. Hell Fuck yeah. yeah. But if you mean the elixir of Christmas cheer, the shield against winter chill, the taxable portion that puts needed funds in the public coffers to comfort little crippled children, then I am for it. This is my position and I will not compromise. Oh, yeah! Yeah. Amen! Can I get an amen? Amen! amen. Now here is Ian, the master of the church of inebriation as he performs a mass as he climbs this tree. From the book of eggnogs and punches, all the lady liquor wanted was to put the rum, the brandy, and the schnapps into the large saucepan. And to bring it to a full boil over medium heat. Reduce the heat, and to add rum, brandy, and schnapps. This is all that she wanted, but none of you, none of you would listen. You must come back, and you must serve lady liquor by stirring until heated through and serve in Irish coffee glasses, garnished with a cinnamon stick and with an apple slice, and make 18 to 20 servings. Kind of adorable and a Let us pray. Well, I stumbled at 2 a.m. all drunk and full of smoke. My wife said I have had enough. That said I'm sick. Get out! So I stumbled down to Kelly's boat across the edge of town, and I told the boys my story, and we had another round.